Well, studies have shown that breakfast and effective learning certainly go hand in hand. But what about families who simply can't afford to feed their children in the morning? One school system that has a lot of students in need is taking action. News 8's Tina Detell is in the New London Newsroom at the day with this story. It's safe to say almost every student eats some type of lunch while they're in school, but some are skipping what's considered the most important meal of the day, even if it's available. Norwich is hoping to change yeah, that. Take take Cereals, everything is whole grain, everything's good for them. We all know the benefits of eating a good breakfast. Their minds are awake, they can go in and study and learn, they retain more knowledge, they do better in school. But in a city where more than 75% of the students are on the state and federally funded free and reduced lunch program, only half grab a bite before class. Some people, like, they're embarrassed to come in, but they shouldn't be. Right now, the kids put in a PIN number when they come to the register, so it's confidential whether or not they're on a reduced or free lunch plan or their parents prepay. Norwich is hoping if breakfast is free for every student, more will grab and go to homeroom. Maybe their friend isn't coming for breakfast, so they don't go for breakfast. So they're thinking, well, maybe I, you know, if my friend's coming for breakfast, I'll go to breakfast. So if we can get, make it free for everyone, they might just say, okay, let's all go for breakfast. A change in routine, they hope, will be a change for the better. It's pretty cool. I mean, the lunch is pretty good here. Everything's healthy. The free breakfasts are expected to be available to all students in September. In the New London Newsroom at the Day, Tina Detell, News 8.